My name is Bill Paulin. I was a captain on the Milwaukee Fire Department and I retired as a command sergeant major in the United States Army. I served 36 years in the Army and 30 years on the Milwaukee Fire Department. Usually, when somebody retires, we'd have a party for them, and those people who worked with them at the present time, and people who worked with them throughout their careers would show up and give them the plaques, and then our firefighters throughout the city would have an opportunity to drive by and say goodbye. And with the pandemic, uh, with our social distancing, and, and you can see we're all wearing masks and gloves, uh, Bill is really a special individual. He's given his heart and soul to the department, and even though we couldn't give him a traditional farewell. Some of us could just come by and wish him farewell on his, on his last day. Well, Bill, congratulations, my friend. Oh, thank you, Chief. Yes. Fire Captain William J. Paul will be entering uncharted territory, retirement. Captain Paul was appointed to the MFD February 5th, 1990. Bill was deployed three different times, 2004, 2006, and 2007 by the United States Army while he was tenured at Engine 1. Captain Paul, utilizing his knowledge and skills from the fire department and his time in the Army, built the cadet program into what is currently known as Cadet Command. His opening speech every year to the cadets is a reminder for the department, which is the MFD is not a me organization, it is a we organization and the finest fire department in the country. Well, nobody will ever know how, um, how fortunate I feel and how proud I feel that I had the opportunity to work with so many, so many great men and women in the military, on the Milwaukee Fire Department. To think that, um, you know, just a, a kid from Milwaukee was able to, to work with the best people that I've ever met in my life, and just that I've been able to walk alongside of them is uh, something that um, is the greatest thing that's ever happened to me. It's a way to honor somebody who's given so much to the department, the city, but also a way for us to have some, some bit of normalcy.